Connectmaster is an inventory management platform for telecommunications networks. The system works in more than nine languages selectable by users during the login process. Users can select specific projects to work or connect it to the operational or base data networks. Connectmaster is structured the information in three panels, Explorer, Fast Access and Navigation panel. The Geo command will start the GIS tool, which stores the Geo data in Oracle Special for seamless integration with industry standard GIS applications. The Explorer panel organizes the network information in a hierarchical structure configured according to the customer needs. The Explorer panel allows sites and components to be organized by their types in categories or subcategories. All the details of the inside plant can be documented and managed, including the riser cables and internal conduits for buildings and MBUs. The context menu will present the available commands for the selected component, including the show in current map to locate the site on the map. In the network site, the physical components are grouped by their subcategories, followed by the logical circuits and electrical networks. It is possible to navigate from the rack level down to the network interfaces and check the circuit information on a port. By right-clicking a component, the context menu is displayed. The Detail command will open the Detail form, which presents the component-relevant information distributed over multiple tabs. You can store the real photos of your device, attach relevant documents such as manuals and datasheets, and manage the physical configuration on the Assembly tab. By selecting a component on the rack, the context menu will display the available options to edit and manage the network device. For a network element, the physical and logical configurations are managed on different tabs. The assembly tab allows users to check and manage the physical configuration, while the logical configuration is managed on the MUX usage tab, including port type, circuits and target connections. The IP Ethernet Configuration tab consolidates information about management IP, port IP addresses, VLAN tags, encapsulation methods, and others. ConnectMaster also interfaces with Microsoft Visio to generate accurate drawings representing the details of the network devices and connections. It is possible to select the stencils and templates and the rack elevation drawing will be automatically created, highlighting the chassis, cards, parts in use, parts available, and others. Users can interface with the network objects by clicking on the Visio shapes, and the Quick View window with available command options will open. It is possible to quickly check the connectivity information for a patch panel. Connect Master allows to import and manage existing drawings and keep track of users' access and history of change. In this example, the data center floor plan is displayed, featuring visual elements linked to the inventory resources. The show in current drawing command will quickly identify and select the desired component on the drawing. It is also possible to navigate from the drawing to open the Quick View menu to access the available commands, including
including running an impact analysis to check affected services and customers in case of failures and outages. Users can navigate from the Geo interface and quickly access component details such as cable structure, including fiber color code and attenuation profile. Cable connectivity information is available on the Connections tab. By clicking on a physical link, the context menu will allow to navigate further down to the physical link details and characteristics. The end-to-end -end circuit connectivity information is displayed in a tabular format with options to display graphically the circuit layout based on the network locations or connected components. The physical link can be displayed on the map or graphically represented in a variety of vision schematics available, customized according to customer needs. The Power Budget tab shows the circuit attenuation profile for the selected frequencies. The power budget calculation considers attenuations for fibers, connectors, splicers, splitters, and other connected components. The information is displayed on tabular and graphical formats. The OTDR function available on the base physical module of ConnectMaster will accurately locate and show the fiber break position on the map. The OTDR report can be generated to display the incident details, allowing faster repair by the network maintenance teams. The reports can be exported to a variety of standard formats and sent via email from the user interface. The Impact Analyzer function can be used to quickly display the affected customer services and circuits, highlighting the disabled and protected circuits. ConnectMaster allows the documentation of splice enclosures, including the fiber connectivity on trays and splitters. The Analyze Splice Plane command will show the connectivity details on tabular format or on a visual drawing with attributes and contents configurable by the user. The Splice Plane shows connected fibers, circuit and cable information and the drawings can be saved in a variety of formats including DWG, PDF and others. For underground networks, ConnectMaster manages the manholes, handholes, ducts, cables, and other components in order to produce the butterfly diagram and report. ConnectMaster uses Google and Bing APIs for a variety of intelligent services, such as address search, routing, and street view, among others. ConnectMaster is suitable for point-to-point -point and point-to-multipoint architectures. 
For a phone circuit, it is possible to see all the connected customers and available parts, including all the connectivity details. The selected customer is highlighted on the diagram and the end-to-end -end circuit details are presented in tabular format. The customer circuit can be displayed on the map or represented on a visual schematic generated on demand. The diagram shows the end-to-end -end connection from the OLT port to the customer ONTs. The power budget is calculated considering splitter, splice and other losses, displaying the maximum and minimum sensitivity information based on selected optics for the end devices. Now let's take a look on how the project management, change management and the FTTX Rapid Network Planning modules can help you to quickly design new customer connections. A new project is created based on the predefined template and auto naming rule. The project activities and schedule are created based on the selected template, allowing users to insert project specific information. The project schedule chart is created allowing comparison between planet and AC scenarios. Authorized users can transition the project to the next steps, triggering emails with personalized messages to the project team. Once the project is on editing mode, you can start designing with the FTTX Rapid Network Planner tool. Select the start location, in this case the data center, and add trench and ductive paths to the design assistant. Now select the desired demand points using the Select Region tool and ask Connect Master to find the appropriate materials for each customer connection. The network is designed based on pre-configured rules customizable to end business needs. Execute will trigger the design process creating all trains, ducts, cables and branch locations on both the Geo and ConnectMaster database. At the customer sites, ConnectMaster will create all the termination panels drop cables and build all internal connections. Connect Master also creates the bill of materials when the design is finished, including the detailed costs and descriptions for materials, operational and other costs. Authorized users can reject or approve the system design and move the project to the next stages. The new objects are visible only within the project mode, preserving the visibility of the operational network until the merge process is completed. Once the merge is finished, the project components will be visible to all users in the operational network mode. Knowing only the physical layers is not enough for an efficient network management. This is why ConnectMaster also manages the logical layers of the networks, supporting industry standard protocols at all network layers such as SONET, WDM, OTN, Ethernet, IP and MPLS. VLAN management supporting different encapsulation methods, hierarchical IP address management for both IPv4 and IPv6 are also supported in ConnectMaster. The network resources are organized by physical components followed by the logical circuits available at the site and the electrical networks. 
it is possible to select a circuit, in this case a DWDM circuit, and ask Connect Master to locate the corresponding cables on the map. All Sonnet and TDM capacitors are available, allowing to control circuit usage levels via the detailed form and statistical dashboards. The detail form will present the circuit information on multiple tabs. The routing editor tab shows the circuit routing information, including sites, multiplexers, cards, ports, and circuits. The routing view tab shows the physical and logical elements of the circuit, allowing the generation of various visual drawings to graphically represent the circuit. The Logical Assignment tab manages the circuit usage, allowing to edit and manage the circuit capacities. MPLS VPN services are managed and documented, including Layer 2 VOL and VPLS and Layer 3 VPRN services. The VPN details such as service access points and pseudo-wire service tunnels are documented including dependencies on lower layer transmission protocols. The Impact Analyzer tool allows to check for affected customer services and circuits, taking advantage of the combined physical and logical inventory management in a single platform. The customer and service names will be displayed, including the circuit capacities and effects for all network layers. The Power Management module allows the documentation of electrical networks calculating the power consumption and power balance available per site in sub-electrical networks. The Electrical Explorer organizes the power networks in a hierarchical way, allowing to navigate from the main power circuit down to the sub-electrical networks available at the rack level and power connections to network elements and power cards. The auto routing engine allows for the efficient search of network resources between sites. In this example, we will search for cable routes. The system will search for available cable routes between selected sites and display the results with the details such as route lengths, number of splice connections, and fiber usage information for each route. The route can be displayed on the map and graphically represented on the visual drawing, showing connections from the patch panels located at end sites all the way to the splice enclosures and other outside and inside plant components. Various network diagrams options are provided by the drawing automation module, allowing to represent the network with all physical and logical connections. Connect Master features the web interface Connect Master Online, supported on any standard web browsers and portable devices. Similarly to the desktop interface, the information is structured in three panels. It is possible to search for specific sites or navigate on the Explorer tree to find a specific site. In a site, it is possible to see all network resources available, to select the desired component and navigate further down to see the details. For a rack, it is possible to check and manage the occupation on each rack unit. Connect Master Online allows authorized users to edit device attributes and general information.
Users can navigate on the Geo interface and select specific components to see the details such as connections and services for a cable. By clicking on a physical link, the path will be highlighted on the map. Connect Master Online also features redlining capabilities, enabling few teams to request project chains and send photos.